This is my grandma's backyard. Uh, the snow's maybe. You can see that if I don't walk right against the door, it's like maybe six inches, but not that bad. And around the bases of her fence, maybe six inches. So not a lot, but um, still pretty and still enough. You can see there, there's a bunch. I don't know why. Anyways, I wanted to show you guys the town a little bit. This is Leeds, South Dakota. There's my grandma's truck. My grandma and my aunt bought a pickup truck to haul stuff. I just wanted to do a quick tour. This is her upstairs. There's a bed and there's a hallway with two beds in it. And then you go back. Sorry it's so blurry. It's bad lighting. And then here's the back bed. It's a little creepy, huh? Yeah, well, sorry about that. Um, there's the back bedroom. I'll turn on the light. Maybe it's less creepy. Um, but yeah, just a cute little upstairs. Uh... I don't know, these cupboards up here, so I used to hide in them. My cousins and I would play hide and seek, and there's a picture of me curled up in one of them. Um, funny story, <laughs> but yeah, this is my grandma's upstairs. So this is looking out my grandma's back window from upstairs at her garden. This is also, you can see all my grandma's canning, canned goods. Uh, these shelves used to be really, really full. You can see there's a lot of empty containers, but um, now that she's 86 years old, she doesn't have as much time to... Or it takes longer to do things in the garden than it used to, but um, there's so many empty ones, it makes me sad. But there's tomatoes, carrots, she used to have lots of plums, uh, applesauce, peas, beans. I don't know what these juices are for sure. Um, there's beets, pickled beets, and looks like all she has at the moment. But well, instead of eating it, you know, just drink it. All of her onions from her garden. So I wanted to show you guys this old washing machine. Uh, it's just it's kind of cool, super old. There's the ringer, but uh, my grandma still uses it for washing her vegetables from the garden. So like when she has a huge thing of them, like a huge bucket of them, she'll just pour them in, and then she doesn't have to do it in the sink. And so it's it makes me laugh every time I see her do it. <laughs> My grandma and her husband are my grandpa who I never met in the middle. And then on the left is my great grandma who I knew for a few years and her husband. And then on this last picture is my mom and my aunts and uncles. So this one is my grandma and her brothers and sisters. And here's a bunch of my cousins. And there's me from my high school senior year picture. More cousins, second cousins, second cousins. Uh, cuz that looks like my cousin's wedding. All right, so this is my grandma and her husband. And then Clifford, her husband's parents, and then my grandma's parents. So these are my grandma's great-grandparents and my grandma's grandparents. So Clifford's mother's parents. Okay, so my grandma's grandmother and my grandpa's grandfather. I never met him, so that's why I keep saying Clifford. All right, so these are my mom's brothers and brother and sisters. And then the little baby one is my mom. Here's my mom. All right, so this is Clifford's grandparents and then his dad's brothers and sisters. And this one right here is his dad. I always thought I always thought this stuff was fun. Uh, my grandma, I don't remember when for sure, but she used to sell uh, snowmobiles, and so there's all the snowmobile stuff that they used to sell. It's so random to me, but this book has um, there's snowmobile stuff, and then like random history of what people owned and uh, things that are just kind of interesting. So that's that. And there's some old uh, birth or uh, marriage certificates in the back. But the other book that my grandma's looking at now has uh, her ancestors up to her, I think it's like 12th generation, but it's my 14th generation, 14 generations back. And that's really interesting. Um, like the earliest people here were in the 1500s for my family. And. Um, it's just, it's, it's neat to see some of those things and like which ships they came over on from which parts of England or Germany or Ireland. It's just, it's, it's been interesting to research some of this stuff with my grandma, but yeah, that's kind of what we've been doing. And 
my my wedding. And then cousins, second cousins, and more second cousins. <laughs>